My YouTube career is over. I'm selling my boat. That's right, it was worth $10 million, remember? I can't afford it anymore. <laughs> Sunny V2 was right. Psych, just kidding. I'm getting a new one, follow me, let's go. Now I can't believe I'm saying this, but this boat has been gifted to me. I'm now officially a Nordcap ambassador and they make amazing boats, guys. I'll make sure to show you everything and make sure you stick around until the end of this video because we're gonna try and see if this boat is faster than my Lamborghini. Yep, we're gonna try max speed, everyone. All right, so we're trying to find like a nice little beach where we can anchor up the boat, but uh, it's a busy day. So, you know, we have to go and hunt for it. We've made it. We found a beautiful spot here. Look at this. We're on the sea on my brand new boat. We'll, we'll just start here with the engine, okay? We've got a 400 horsepower V10. I don't even know how to drive. That's a lot of horses. But it works and it works very well. I haven't gone that fast yet because I'm a bit scared, but like 35 knots is comfortable. <laughs> then, okay, would you check this out? This right here, ladies and gentlemen, is a beautiful seating area, but I'm alone. Well, my girlfriend's with me most of the time, but this is a lot of space for just me and her. But we can sit everywhere. You see, we can sit here. We've got a kitchen here, by the way. I'll show you later. We can sit here. <laughs> we can eat here. Or if we bring our friends, we can eat here. Look at that. We've got a whole dining solution here. It's incredible. This right here is the brand of the boat, Nord Cup, beautifully stitched inside. Uh, we've got a fridge, but before I show you that, check this out. Yes. Okay, I made it a mess. I'm sorry. We've got soap with real water. Wait. Look at that, a sink, so I can wash my hands. <laughs> I've got a gas stove in case I wanna do some cooking, but um, I'm gonna have to ask Santa if she can cook for me because I have no idea how to cook. But anyway, I wanna just show you the fridge. We'll do a fridge tour. Come in here. I only drink water, water. We do not look at these ones. This is water. I only drink water on this boat. Um, anyway, we've got my seating area. This is where I spend most of the time, comfortably seated on my cockpit chair. Uh, we've got two screens. Actually, we've got three screens. The engine screen, the second screen, and the first screen. This one I use for navigation. This one I use for some information. A lot of buttons. Half of them, I don't know what they mean. I'm kidding. Obviously, I do, but uh, they're not so important. The throttle, this one you use to go forwards or backwards. It's very dangerous. I have to be very, very careful. We've got more seating areas. And you know, the, the fun part is, Everything is transformable. So you think, oh wow, Jelly, nice sofa, but this is gonna hurt your back, right? Well, guess what? Incline. Now I can get comfortable with just laying down. It's perfect. And you think, well, Jelly, where are you gonna put all your stuff? Well, let me show you, okay? <laughs> this boat has everything. First, we put the seat back, and then watch this. Oh, yeah. We've got storage, more water. See, I only drink water, more water and some toilet paper. Incredible. And there's actually storage everywhere. You can also put a whole like canopy up so that the sun doesn't burn you alive. But let me tell you about something else. We can sleep on this boat. Yeah, not outside. We have an actual indoor area with a proper bathroom, toilet and, and two bedrooms. I'm not kidding, I'm not kidding. But first, before we go in there, we can also lay here. This is another bed, not for sleeping, more for like sun, sun bed, you know, sunbathing. People like to do that these days, get a nice little tan in. But there's something special about this bed and I'm gonna show you. <laughs> it's also a um, open roof thing for our bed so we can breathe inside. And at the same time, it gives an incline to the sunbed. It's, this boat is genius. Maybe you should come inside and, and, and have a look here. I'll, I'll be there. Welcome inside. This is where I sleep. Yep. We've actually got our pillows over here. Um, I know that makes no sense at all. Most people would probably put their head there. You see, we've got the lamps to sleep there like this. But for some reason, I just prefer to lay the other way because then I have a whole lot more space because the boat kind of goes inwards towards the front. This is the front of the boat. But we got a lot of space. Look at this. We can easily sleep here with like five people. But like I said, it's usually just me and Santa. So that doesn't really happen. But we do have a second bedroom and the second bedroom is down there. I'm going to show you. Now I'm in the second bedroom. I can stretch my legs. Trust me. Y usually nobody sleeps in here. See this, this kind of becomes a storage area because uh, well, it's nice to put down things down here. It's, it's out of the way, but you can sleep here. Look, I've got lighting and a privacy curtain. Good night. Excuse me. Privacy, please. <laughs> 
I'm just kidding. This is my toilet room. I've got a mirror in front of me. You can't see it. I've got a toilet, electric toilet, by the way. It flushes electrically, which is a huge deal on, on boats. Trust me. Uh, I've got a little sink, a little window with a curtain. We can have more privacy if we want it. Uh, we got some storage spaces. You know, it, this boat is incredible. And to be honest, there's probably like a hundred things I haven't shown you, including the top floor, the second floor, third floor, uh, the basement, but it doesn't matter. We'll just um, show you some other things. This little machine is actually very special and important to me. This can start the ventilation or you can start heating. So the inside of the boat will become warm in case it's a cold, frisky night out. I don't know why it would be because it's summer, but in case it is, we can heat the inside of the boat. And on top of that, this also allows you to heat water. Yep, we can take warm showers, which also is a huge deal on boats, trust me. All right, you might think the salt water is really, really clean. Well, it is, but it's better to take a shower. Watch this. Oh, we just pull it out. We just pull it out like that. Oh, oh so nice. It's really warm as well. Wow, I can shower on my boat. Well, that was amazing, but it's time to take this big boat out for a spin. And if you can hear, yeah, we actually have a sports exhaust button. Listen to it right now. And now, the boat is quiet. Now, some of you might be wondering, well, Jelly, didn't you buy a boat like two years ago? Yes, I did. It felt like it was half the size of this one. This one's much bigger. I've sold that one, all right? I started a collaboration with North Cup, who've landed me this amazing boat. And well, I'm just so happy with it and thankful for the opportunity. So thank you, North Cup, and um, I'm just speechless. Now, obviously, there's so many things that I didn't show you on this boat, like the radio, all the speakers, but we can't play any music because it's all copyrighted. However, we can play this song. And that's a good one. Something I do need on this boat. I kind of want to, I kind of want to be able to play games here. Hmm. I don't know. I can make another video on it if you want. Over here, we've got two little sticks. You might be like, Charlie, what are they for? Well, these are little joysticks and they actually make a sound. Listen to this. Wow. These allow me to turn the boat without actually having to use the engine. So uh, yeah, we've got like extra propellers underneath the boat. I know, it's cool, right? We've got two of them, watch. We can do 360 no scopes. We're literally doing 360s right now. <laughs> and when I press this button, I can play video games using the steering wheel. Watch this. <laughs> oh my God. Oh, that was pretty bad. All right, take it for a spin. You ready to see what power looks like? 400 horses. They're all stuck in a dungeon. Poor horses. Look at that. Wow. Going 15 miles per hour, 20, 25, 30. Oh, we're going really quick. Yep, we're going fast. Yeah, that's a cool boat. Mine's cooler though. Got some bumps. Bumpy, bumpy. No problem, no problem. All right, it's time. This is what you're all waiting for, isn't it? It's time to try top speed. Here we go. All right. Oh, that's quick. That is quick. 20 knots, 25 knots, 30 knots. A little bumpy, okay. 30, 40, 40 knots. Oh my God, a little bumpy. Oh, we're kind of flying over here. 47 knots. Let's see, what speed can we get? 48, 48 and a half, 49. We're flying. It's a good thing we don't have wings. <laughs> okay, cameraman is getting a little upset, so I'll slow it down. <laughs> I think we just about touched 50. <laughs> Thanks for watching and thank you, Nordcap, for this incredible opportunity. I can't wait to show you guys more boat content. In case you want to see more, make sure you subscribe.